It's good to see you, Mr. Evans. How are you feeling? And how did the job search go? Did you find anything? Good. That's the spirit. Okay, Mr. Evans. How about we try another ink blot? Same as before. I'll ask some questions and there are no wrong answers. What do you see in front of you? How does that make you feel? And what about now? What do you see? Thank you. Quite interesting. A change in perspective can be powerful. That's enough for today. I wish you good luck, Mr. Evans. I think you want the job more than you let show, which isn't a bad thing. We'll meet again the same time next week. Who's next? Mr. John Evans. You're next. Mr. Evans. Please, sit down. Okay, Mr. Evans. Let's cut right to the chase. Let's take a look at your resume. That's exactly the qualifications we're looking for. How about the short story from the job posting? You wrote this? It's not bad, but I'm not convinced. How about you prove to me right here, right now, that you've got the skills? Write us a short story. Any topic.
think that's enough. A little cliche, but well written. Welcome aboard, John. You've got the job. Hello, Mr. Evans. Nice to see you again. How are you doing? And did you have the job interview? How did it go? Congratulations, Mr. Evans. That's great news. Let's continue our work with the ink blots. I know they're confusing, but I think we're making progress. What comes to mind when you look at this? What name would you give this picture? Would you associate this with weakness or strength? Last question, Mr. Evans. Which would you choose to be, a dragon or a panther? Thank you, Mr. Evans. That's enough for now. I think we're getting somewhere. Good luck at your new job. I look forward to hearing about it. Let's get started, John. You'll find everything you need on your disk.
Evans, you know I love the creativity, but I need you to focus on the job. This is an important one for us. Good afternoon, Mr. Evans. Please, make yourself comfortable. So, tell me, how are you feeling about your new job? Progress takes effort and time, Mr. Evans. It pays off in the long term. I think one day you'll agree with me. Do you think staying still would have been better than what you've achieved? Fair enough, Mr. Evans. We can keep going. We have one more ink blot to look at. I think you'll like this one. Do you see anything familiar? Is there chaos or order? And how does that make you feel? Thank you. Those responses have been very enlightening. You've come a long way in these last sessions, Mr. Evans. Our time is up for today, but I want you to keep your mind open to new opportunities. John, we just got a call from the client. I know it's Saturday, but we really need the next chapter of the story by 5 p.m. today. I'm counting on you, John. I see bright things in the future for you.
Collins will be kicking it off, and here comes... Sorry about the noise. I just moved on upstairs and I don't want to start off on the wrong foot with anyone. Let me know if it gets too loud again.